Yes, Abdul. How are you? This uh, verse you were talking about, uh, this is actually uh, a proof that this is the word of God. How? This verse. How? The Allah mm. is talking about a small group which was Jewish mm. and they and they believed in the divinity of one who was called Ezra mm. and he is called uh, Hezekiel in the Bible. Mm. It, it, it was it was a smaller group yes this was a small group it's okay not guys I, I want you to be my witness I want you guys to be my witness you said a smaller group correct yes this was okay a small so why group he was saying this... okay hold on so why he was saying the Jews if they are a smaller group why he called them the Jews yes the the text is saying the Jews but it not mean all the Jews this is a particular group oh so you, was... you are saying to me Allah he made a mistake he should add the word some of the Jews no there is no mistake you you are okay you are getting let me get you wrong. busted let me get you busted show me the reference of what you are saying that some of the Jews according to the tafsir one Jew only believe in that while you are lying it was only one Jew you know who is the best one don't tell it. me don't tell me don't tell me who can answer it you answer it why you tell me who can answer it you tell me show me from the tafsir it says some of the jews it says that only one jews and that to prove again that the quran is a stupid book because if it's only one jew why he says the jews and not only that he says the jews and then he said the christians so he is making a statement about all of them the christians and the jews both of them they worship a person his name is one is his name is israel and the other one his name is christ and they say he is the son of Allah. He did not say some of the Jews. No, this this was like the divine. Like you believe that Jesus is divine, yeah? Uh, don't change the topic. You said you said a few of the Jews believe in that. Show me the show me the reference. It was only one Jew. Yes, I will show okay. you. Okay, okay. Show me, show me. Okay, okay go ahead. Give me the reference. I, I sent to you this. Okay. I sent you the the link here mm. in your Skype. All right. And I want you to go to uh, the uh, mm. go to uh, when it's in three minutes and twenty seconds. We can we can play videos. Give me reference. Give me reference. Don't don't give me videos. Just to be stupid. Here. Give me a reference. Don't give me YouTube. We can't play YouTube. We have limited. We cannot play YouTube many. We can play for a, a second. It's a it's my, a short and it's my a friend. Rabbi give me. I don't care. Give me the reference. Which is color? He say what you are saying, and we open it, and this everybody is a will rabbi, see. Rabbi, rabbi. What rabbi? This is a stupid. This is no. This is Toby Singer, right? He said it clearly that we wouldn't have a, such a book. We don't have such a name. He said we don't have such a name. Is that to weave a singer? Is that to weave a singer? Is that to weave a singer? He said we don't have such a name. We never heard of such a name. He said that clearly. No, he says that here that it was they have they have discovered that that there was a Jewish group <laughs> that believed that Ezra. My which friend, is, is my friend. First of all, first of all, there's no guy. His name is Ezra in the Quran. It says Uzair, and Ezra is not Uzair. Do you see it? Yes, this this Jewish uh, no, but then, this this guy his name is Ezra and at the same time if you say to me they discover they discover how in the world your God he says the Jews they say why he is saying because those will not be Jews if they are worshiping that if they are doing that as an example today We have people they call themselves Jehovah's Witnesses. We call them Jehovah's Witnesses We don't call them Christians. They are the Christians So if you say that Jehovah's Witnesses are the Christians and people will laugh at you if we say the Mormon are the Christian people will laugh at you so you cannot call them the Jews if they are not Jews so your God here he made a poo-poo same time not only they worship Hosea what about verse number 31 it says they took their rabbis as God yes okay but can you name for me the rabbi? Don't, don't jump can you can, name, can, can, can you can, can you I name answer? for me now you cannot answer give me the reference can I answer yeah give me the reference can, can I answer? Can okay, you just be you quiet. See, you see, seconds. Because you are trying not to answer, I will go myself and show you no, the difference. Do you, do, you, do you want that? Do you want that? Do you want can to show, you, you want show you the can reference? You stop, can you stop talking so I can yeah, answer? But why you don't want to give me a reference? Why, why you don't let me answer? I will let you answer, but why you don't give me a reference? You are talking to I, me. I give you the link. Why what, don't you what, open this it? Is a, this is a video. I don't play videos. Give me a reference. 
This is our rabbi who talking. I this don't care. I don't care who is he. This is this is a stupid answer. Give me uh, for us. We have books. Either you show me from the Bible or you show me where it says in your books that there is a groups only a group. It says that according to the seer, it says there is only one person. They are the best who knows what they, they believe was and what. Thank they were you very not. much, they guys. Did, did, he, did, did he say that the Jews they are the best to know what they believe? No, this is this is a, he's talking about. This, I am, uh, yeah, group. okay. Do uh, you just say they are the best to know? Do you admit that the, the rabbi are the best to know? Yes or no? About this situation, about only, the, Jews, yes. only the situation, only only the what? situation, only the situation they knew, the rest they do not know. The best who can talk about this is the rabbi, okay? But there are, uh, do you accept what they say or accept only this? They have discovered that they my friend where you discover who, who show believes. me okay show me the reference the guy whatever he said to you in the in the video show me the reference I, where we discover I that the link. I no, don't you give me the go link. and give me a link of a stupid I video you. Why you don't, why are first you of scared, all man? first of all the guy you gave me he is no rabbi he is a donkey secondly secondly uh, of yes course. But it don't go down your throat. He's a donkey. No, course. no, because you have to give me reference. Give me reference. What, what, what the rabbi said to you? Give me the reference. So let's open it. He's a Jew. He knew better than Who you. Who care? Okay, he's a Jew. He knew better than you. Then. Yes, he knew better okay. than me. Of course. Not a single word in the Bible mentioned that there is anyone worship Ozair. Otherwise, the Jews themselves in the in the in the Bible it should say there is a person who said that, and this is we are against him. The Bible mentioned all the false cults and what the Jews they did in their history. So how come they did not mention that? So we discover what discover. He said that the Jews they said that's mean all the Jews. He did not say some of the Jews. So your Quran is making a mistake. If even if if even if this rabbi is saying the truth, because if Allah is God and He know how to speak Arabic, He should not say the Jews. He says some of the Jews. Can I can I answer this? Go what ahead. You just say hmm. okay. Uh, the Quran is not a fairy tale book. He don't speak like uh, me or you. You understand? How? This is how he he give he, he speak in his way. You know. And if you want to know a history, you have to go and see the history. Okay. If you want to see what is about, he don't speak in, in like a history book or fairy tale book. Uh, so how the Quran says? As long as we are talking about speak, fairy tale. Okay, okay. We are talking about. Okay. Okay, we are talking about we are talking about fairy tales and the Jews. How come that Allah he says that Suleiman he have a flying carpet? If he said that he had that, so what? Okay, so is a second ago, guys, listen to this. The Quran is not a fairy tale book, but the Muslim believe that Suleiman he have a flying carpet, and he don't have a problem with that. So how you say to me is not a fairy tale book, and you believe that Suleiman he have a, a flying carpet can fit for six hundred thousand chairs. And he carry all his kingdoms and all his donkeys and all his horses and all his soldiers in the top of flying carpet. Uh, let me correct you mm. that the 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 copper was not the one who was flying. He had the power of the wind, so the wind was turning. That's a lie. You, do you want me to get you busted? Yes, you can okay. see. He, he what, had, he had the, what, the power, what interpretation? What interpretation? you like to see? Should we go to Ibn Kathir or someone else? Allah give him the control to no the problem. Let us see. The, let us see. Okay, let us see if you are saying the truth or not. If let us see if this is what you are saying is the truth. You are. You, will hold, on, to this. hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Don't chat. don't run. Don't the don't run. Yeah, Jewish the rabbi group. the rabbi agree with me, not with you. You Muslims are a bunch of flyers. Here we oh, go. This is Ibn Kathir. This is Ibn Kathir. This is Ibn Kathir. Fairy tale stories. Quran. Look at this. This is stupid. This cannot be God. This is the Nikathir. Read with me carefully. You say that Allah He controlled the wind. Huh? Yes, He controlled the wind, but He have a flying carpet. Allah won't control the wind. Read carefully. Read carefully. Here we go. This is your scholar Ibn Kathir. Unless you want to say Ibn Kathir is a liar too. Read carefully with me. And by the way, the translation in English is funny and stupid. It's not. It's not true. But anyway, let us see. Here we go. <clears throat> Solomon, who was the one who get control? Okay, of the wind. no problem. Yes, Suleiman, he controlled the flying carpet. And to Suleiman, we subjected the wind strongly. Ragging, ragging means we subjected the uh, the the strong wind to Suleiman. He can continue uh, explaining. And we of everything, we are all knower. He had a mat made of wood on which he would place the equipment of his kingship: horses, camels, tents, and troops. And then he would command the wind to carry it. Do you agree with that? 
He commanded the wind to carry. Did you to carry what? Read? To carry the mat. Yes, the well, wind. Well, this is the flying carpet is the flying carpet that the wind is going to carry the mat and the fly. This is what the flying carpet is. So he command the wind and the wind go underneath the flying carpet and they, 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 it, it carry him. So you believe and he put his horses, his troops, his the whole kingdom, the whole kingship is in the top of flying carpet. Yes, he had he had the cap cap capacity. To how, do that how big how, how big this flying carpet to fit for 600,000 chairs and all the camels, all the horses, all the chickens, all the donkeys, all the animals in his in the top of it. How it's big the it is. wind it's the wind you don't my understand. friend it says here there's a mat he had a mat made of wood do you read you know how to read he yes, had a mat this wind take up the mat okay how big the mat is to carry all the kingdom the whole kingdom is a I flying don't care how big. my friend the trump thing for me what do you mean how big it is the whole kingdom of of david of solomon is flying how how many according okay. to your tafsir according to your tafsir 600000 chairs for people to sit Plus all his soldiers, plus all his horses, plus all his ministers, plus all his birds, because he have an army of genie, he have an army of, of, uh, of birds. All of what them in genie? the top. What? What is genie? Genie? What, you do not know? Jin, Jin. It's the name Jin. Yeah, genie. genie. Genie in the ball. Don't you know the song? What is genie? Hmm. You have to say correctly. okay. Let me genie. ask you. You may okay as long as you stuck with the genie. Do you believe that genie they used to work for Suleiman? Of course. Okay, what they do for him? They served him whatever he said. How they did do what it. they do? What they do? Explain to us. Everything. They was like uh, they they did everything which he commanded. Like what? Like what? Give us an answer. Like everything, if you wanted to do something, they they do it. Okay, is it true? You keep saying everything, everything. Is it true that they die for him and they bring him jewelries from the ocean? I have not heard about that, so I cannot comment. This is from the Quran. So Suleiman, he have a team of genie, shaitan. They are shaitan, not only genie, they are shaitan. They die for him to get him jewels from the ocean. Is that a fairy tale story or this is it true? If the Quran says that, that's true. Everything in Quran is 100% true. Okay, let me ask you a question. If mm -hmm. Shaitan, he died for Suleiman to give him jewels, that means Shaitan is a good guy. Shaitan, it's not a, talking about this Shaitan you're thinking about. This is a jinn. No, it says Shaitan. Doesn't say jinn. Shaitan. But you have to understand no. there are different different Shaitans. You must doesn't matter. Are you, you saying? No are you clue, saying huh? to me? Are you saying to me this is a Muslim Shaitan? It's not about Muslim Shaitan. I'm there asking you. Shaitans. Don't tell me different Shaitan. No, Shaitan is Shaitan. Is he a Muslim Shaitan or he you is? You're not the one who choose. You're not a Muslim. I, I am asking you. I'm you. asking you. Is he a Muslim Shaitan or not a Muslim Shaitan? Either you say he's a Muslim Shaitan or you say he's not. He's a jinn, and he was. He, he was, he was not called. He was called Shaitan in the Quran. Don't play games. He was called Shaitan, and Shaitan means Satan. So Satan, he worked for Suleiman. Don't don't play games. He did not say genie. He didn't say genie. He said Shaitan. Shaitan is a genie. Yes, this is the kind. But he is a Satan. So he said Shaitans, and not only Shaitan, Shaitan, which means many of Satan's. They die for him. Do you agree with that? Is he a Muslim Shaitan or he is not a Muslim Shaitan? In the Arabic, what does it say if you read? You do not know Arabic, don't you? Can you read? Do you know Arabic? No, I, I do not know. You, come on, read. Well, I don't know Arabic. You know Arabic. You tell me. You tell me you are a Muslim. You know better. Know. You, are you, you are the one who you told me. The you are the one who told me I'm a Muslim. I know better than you. Okay, read it for us. I Go have ahead. never say I'm no better than you. Uh, okay, here we go. Say. I say. Shut up. Okay. Wamina shayatin. Wamina shayatin. And by the way, the word shayatin here is written wrongly. You see, there's an alif missing. A shayateen written very stupidly in the Quran. Women as shayateen, many a rusuna lahu. So, mm -hmm. from the Satans who they are diving for him. So, those Satans are the good Satans or bad Satans? I don't understand why you change the subject. We talked about the Jewish, and now you are. We talking are talking about, about the fairy tales. Is... Everything you have there is a fairy tale. There's no Jews believe in Uzair. We cannot find one. And the Quran says all the Jews did not say one or two. And you are lying, trying to cover up for Muhammad. And how we have a problem. And by the way, not only that, 
the verse number 31 it says that Allah he said that the Jews they took their rabbis as gods can you name for me one rabbi he became a god we don't change the topic who is huh? the rabbi who is the rabbi the Jews they took him as God you can go and look it up this Tuvia singer he's talking he's a rabbi he's uh, Abdul, a Tuvia, rabbi. Tuvia singer let me speak okay you don't let me speak. I, 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 I got you but I get him busted there go watch my videos about him and let me ask you to weave a singer he said that they, they found the Uzair is a son of Allah are you sure no there was a group in in uh, Yemen they, mm. they were Jewish there mm. was a small group they believed that he was a divine uh, son of God and that's why the Prophet Muhammad didn't. Uh, uh, he he told them this is not true. That's why this uh, ayah come down. I want to get you busted? Why you don't open the link? Do you want me to get you busted? Here we go. This is the Tuvia Sankar. I send you the link. Why you don't open it? I am open it. Everybody who is here. I am open. I, 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 I hold give on. You the link to hold the on. I am open. Everybody it. open it and go for okay. three minutes. Uh, you okay. will see what he say. Okay, hold on, hold on. He's not a Muslim. He's a rabbi, Jewish rabbi. He's he's not a Muslim. So why is he telling us this? Well, thing? he's he, uh, okay. He is he is the person who said too that the Virgin Mary is a lie. Do you agree with him? No, I don't agree. Okay, so then shut up. Don't either you bring him because that means he's a liar. So either we accept no. him. Okay. So so do you accept him to be a person who said the truth, or he is a liar? Tell me the truth now. Do you that, accept him? That to is be? his belief. No. no. Okay. His belief. So why the Quran says that? Don't the Jewish don't believe he's the Messiah. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. You Jewish, they don't believe he's the Messiah, but he said that the Virgin Mary was not a virgin. This is a Roman old pagan belief. Do you agree with him? Yes, the Jews believe that she was raped by a Roman soldier. That's a, that's a stupid. No Jews, they say that. This is a lie. Secondly, you yes, are the one who said to me. You can read. In okay, the all, all done. Okay, let, let, let me let me let me find you. Here we go. Roman soldier. All done. All done. Here we go. This is a video I made for this guy, who you call him Rabbi. Okay. Listen, so and name let, was hold, on, Lord, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, shut up, shut up, let us play the video, don't you want to play the video? You yes, gave yes, me a video, okay, let's play it, shut up, so we can play it. Yes, go to three minutes. Shut up. We don't have, we don't shut have to up. listen to everything. Shut up. Shut up. Always he speaks good about Muhammad, Muhammad is a wonderful man. Let us play. Uh, he attacked Christianity for sure, because <laughs> this who know every person. <laughs> First of all, the questions they come to them. Uh, Let us see. I'm trying nothing. to find where he spoke. You know, he's a denying that's the chap. See, he, he's a person who knows every verse in the Quran right away. Um, um, and he starts like he, he's, he is a he's a very professional Jew. Denying that's the chap. See, um, the was for him before, but they came that they just received the question, and the guy supposedly he knew what he's talking about. Listen carefully. That's an interesting question. Um, that comes from um, the Quran, it's chapter 9, it's the chapter. He is a person who knows every verse in the Quran, right away. Now, what I'm trying to explain here, guys, those people, they are false people. They, you know, he claimed that he just received a question, and he did not, he, like he was surprised, and he hold his beard, and he says, ah, I think this was in Quran, chapter 9. But this guy, this is a question, they have it from before, and they prepared themselves for it. Listen. What he would say about Ozair. Um, um, and he start like he, he is a he's a very professional Jew. <laughs> he start like scratching his beast. Yeah, this is in chapter nine, verse number. Supposedly he knew the Quran by heart. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. After called repentance or it's a tabba. See? And um is the chapter nine, uh, Surah nine, verse thirty. Even he knows the verse number. Um and there it says that um the Jews say that um, the Ezra is the son of God. The Christians say that Allah, that uh, the Christians say that the Messiah is the son of God. They speak with their mouths, um, but they really, what look, they look, have look. essentially. Look how professional this Jew is. He's trying to remember. They speak in their mouth. Mm -hmm. Um, 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 amazing actor. I mean, look, 
he can quote it word by word, but he cannot remember it still. You see, like he's reading it, but um, um, <laughs> is something they receive from the past and they're speaking absolutely nonsense and uh, essentially the um, and then and and God and Allah is against them because what they're saying essentially is a perversion, something essentially like that. And it was so. Now, what's very intriguing about this passage in the Quran is that, um, of course, everybody who reads it is going, "Wait, I don't know any Jew who believes that Ezra, a great prophet, and incidentally is considered." A prophet in Islam as well. First of all, it's not Ezra; it is Hosea. Uh, I don't know any Jew who believes that. Ezra Guys, Ezra is a prophet in Islam too. There is a prophet in Islam. His name is Ezra. Look at this pupu. <laughs> nice to meet you. <laughs> in Islam, there is a prophet. His name is Ezra. <laughs> Can you show me where it gets from? From Abdul. Mm. Brother, I like your beard. I know you work in jewelries. I know you are making good money from the Muslims. But when you make a lie, I mean, okay, show us where, where in Islam the Quran teach that there's a prophet. His name is Ezra. I want to see the name, please. In Islam, there's a prophet. His name is Ezra. What a potato. Scratch your beard stronger. Maybe the information would be fixed. Ezra was the son of God. And we say the son of God that means the son of god in a greek sense in a crystal it, the way christians believe that jesus was the son of god that he was divine okay? there's another term son of god to separate that that all muslims believe that we're all children of god they don't, that's not the look at this lie he just say this guy is a, is a is a fraud he said the muslims they believe that all of us we are children of god let me get let me shut him up this is not what the Quran is talking about. This is number one. Number two, the Muslim don't believe in that. You're a liar. Here we go. This is the Quran. I cannot find chapter five, verse number 18. I cannot find more hypocrite that this guy, this guy, he lives in Indonesia and he do business with the Muslims. He lives between them. So he's very hypocrite. The Jews and the Christians say we are the ch Allah children and his beloved ones. Say, then why does he punish you with his sin? So why you lie, you say that the Christian, the, the, the Muslims, all of us, we believe that we are children of God. Why you are a liar? This is an idea totally rejected by Muslims. The Muslims believe that they are a slave of Allah and they don't believe they are children of Allah. Corrupt false rabbi. Continue. Guys, Muslims believe that they are children of God. Muslims believe that they are children of God too. <laughs> true, true. This is true, absolutely, Abdul. All Muslims believe that they are children of God. Absolutely, absolutely. I mean, what, what, what this guy he eat before he talk? I mean, he is the most hypocrite, corrupt person just because he is doing business with the Muslims in the Muslim country. He is willing to sell anything. The Muslim believe that there is a Jew doing business. Let us make it clear. Let's go. Literally, Ezra was a divine being, and and he, he the Muhammad actually equates the the Jews believing that Ezra is the son of God with Christians who believe that the Messiah, namely Jesus Isa, is the son of God, and then he just condemns it. Now, it's very intriguing is that there are no Jews that I've ever met in my life that believe that. See. <laughs> and the, the the Islamic commentators, and there's an enormous amount of literature written on this passage by some by ancient commentators of Islam who were confronted with the same question: What 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 Jews are we talking about? So the the commentators, the Islamic commentators on this, are absolutely brilliant. Brilliant. Um, mm. Many of them say that there was this Jew. I think the name they guys even he remember the name you remember from the book you see how, how they act and I'm trying to explain to you here like um, his name like trying he's to be like he is a scholar who knows everything he prepared for this topic five days ago 
and now like he's um i think his name um <laughs> so the interpretation even the name I mean, so anyway as you see here even the scars of the muslims they believe it was only one guy so how allah he says that the jews they say allah this they say Uzair, the son of allah the jews not one if it's only one and why it's even important to say his name why even important to mention his cult if it's just one person? Imagine we have millions of Christians believe that Jesus is God, and then we mention one, and we call him. We call we call because of him the Christians. They say that is a fabrication because the Muslims, when they try to explain, they could not find an answer for this. This is a mistake in the Quran. There's no Jew believing that guy, his name is Uzair, and it's not Isra. And Muhammad, he said, the Jews. The second you say the Jews, it means all the Jews. Not one, not two, not three, not four. If Allah, let us say there's a group of the Jews, then Allah, he made a mistake, and the Muslims have to admit he should not say the Jews. If only a group of the Christian believe that Jesus is God, then he should say some of the Jews and some of the Christians. But as you see, he did not say that. He said the Jews, they say, they say. Change the translation. You see, in Arabic it says, وَقَالَتِ الْيَهُودِ Not وَقَالَ a Jew. قَالَتْ They said, the Jews. Change the translation so we can laugh. Uh, translation of uh, who is the translator here? Okay, let us go to different one. Shakir, Shakur, Shuku Shuku. The Jews say, Ozair. You see here, you see the first translation here. The, the clear word appear. It's not Ezra. They try to fabricate, try to find a name close to this name. They could not find except Ezra, but nowhere in the Quran says Ezra. What Ezra? It says Uzair, and there's a huge difference between Uzair and Ezra. He is the son of Allah. The Jews they say it, the same as the Christian. Change the translator. I'm showing you all translations so you can you know you can you can see. Shakir, let us go to uh, uh, what? Uh, Biktar. It's the same, same garbage, you know. But anyway, obviously it's a mistake. And you notice that this guy, he decided not to talk about the fairy tale because you are the one who mentioned to me the Quran is not a fairy tale book. But when we get him busted, that shayateen, they work for Allah to collect money for Allah because Suleiman is a prophet of Allah. Let us call him back and see why he's trying to run away. Yes, hello. Yes, Abdul. So you say you uh, this uh, to be a singer. He's he, he's uh, making an act, huh? Well, yeah, obviously. Don't you think so? So what what is your uh, proof that he do that? Obviously, did you hear the? Did you? I mean, that the topic. The guy he is trying to remember the verse, but he can quote it word by word. Either you remember it or you don't remember it. Why you can have a, you can think and remember? Why not? no? There's no way that you don't remember it, but you remember it. Either you remember it because he is quoting even the quotation as it is letter by letter word by word there's no way you don't remember it and you need to squeeze your beard to remember it but you know it all so this, this is obviously it's a it's a it's a scam Sec, in the same time this guy he said that only one jew believe in that according to the brilliant interpretation brilliant one did you hear him yes this is the miracle okay hold on okay so who is the liar brilliant interpretation yeah. all of them agree that only one jew you told me that he said that there's a group in yemen they did that 
So why the, why do your scholars they say one Jew and he said the group as according to you? Which one of them is liar? But it can be a group or it can be one. We don't know. No, uh, we know. We know the Quran says the Jews. The Quran says all the Jews, not one Jew. But the Quran it can be one particular. No, it cannot be... be one. It cannot be one because simply it says the Jews. The Quran. Mm -hmm. you, don't you Muslims you claim that the Quran is a powerful Arabic? Yes, so but if so if there is a guy that... now if there is a guy secondly this is a mistake because if there is a guy now believe that Rashad Khalifa is a prophet is he a Muslim or he's out of Islam no he's out of Islam okay so I can I say the Muslim believe Rashad Khalifa is a prophet or I should say that he is not a Muslim no you you you, you don't understand that this uh, is talking about a, 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 a group you know my friend, where is the group? But the group, I'm asking you. If Rashad Khalifa, Rashad Khalifa, he have a group too. Rashad Khalifa is not one person. He have a group. Can I say that the Muslim believe Rashad Khalifa is a prophet, or this is not a true? You said no. So here, if even if this is true, this is stupid, because the right. Jews don't believe in that. This is the miracle. This is the proof that this is a uh, word. <laughs> How this is a miracle? If we cannot find the Uzair in the old Bible. Can you find me the word, uh, uh, the guy, his name is Uzair, even in the Old Testament? I want to see it. There's no such a name. So the name is wrong. We cannot no, find anyone the believing. Names in the Bible are corrupted. Can you find me? Okay, what do you mean corrupted? The name, the name is of the Bible corrupted? Jesus, what is his name? Yeshua. Yeshua. Why you say Jesus? Because this is the one they translate. They could not make the same letters in Hebrew. There's letters in Hebrew. They are not exist in the, in the Greek. Uh, how come? There's no like you. What say to me the name of your prophet? <laughs> say to what me the name. Like say, to, say to me the name of your prophet. No, but you understand. No, no. Say to me the name of your prophet. Stop, stop, stop. Say to me the name of your prophet. Was was his name Jesus? Say to me prophet? the name of your prophet, please. Say to me the name of your prophet. Go ahead. His name is Muhammad sallallahu okay. alaihi wasallam. Okay. So why 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 the majority of the Muslims? Okay. His, his name, name is Mustafa. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. okay. Okay, so his name is uh, so his name is Muhammad. So why in English you say Muhammad? <coughs> hmm? Why in English you say Muhammad, not Muhammad? Muhammad. But I cannot find I cannot find in the English anyone saying Muhammad. He says Muhammad. Which one is correct? What are you talking about? If we read the English translation, we see that the name of your prophet became Muhammad, not Muhammad. You're talking about Muhammad, or what are you talking about? Yeah, now? in English, the name is Muhammad. The French people mm -hmm. they say Muhammad. So is mm -hmm. that a, is that the same name, or you don't accept it no more? So the same in the Hebrew, those letters are exist in the Hebrew, are not exist in the Latin language. So they have to replace the letters. Here they go. You do the same. Muhammad is coming as Muhammad. There's nothing. It's called Muhammad. It is Muhammad. Now you said to me a second ago, his name is Muhammad and his name is Ahmad. How he have many names and his name is Mustafa. Explain it to us. How can Jesus has many names? His name He's is God. Jesus. His name is all the oh, 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 isn't it the Quran says that all the beautiful names belong to Allah? Yes. Okay. Is Muhammad Allah? No, he's not Allah. Okay. So God he have attribute. Why Muhammad he have many names? Explain to us. This is this is the name we gave him. Because he was the chosen one, he was the most. You praised. gave you gave him. He's you gave him. Praised. You are the one who gave him those names. No, not me. Who gave him those names? I don't know, but this is his names. Okay, his name is Muhammad or Ahmad. Why the Quran says once Muhammad, once he says Ahmad? Because this is the the, the name he have. Who is uh, the guy? He have two names, three names, four names at the same time. Who is Esau? Who is what? Esau. Esau? Oh. I don't know. You tell me who is Esau. Ah, you don't know your religion so good. No, this I do not a, know. You tell me. For Jesus. Okay, so you are saying to me your prophet, he copied Esau? No, his, his uh, uh, name is Isa. Isa. So what Esau is? So wh why you don't call him Esau? <laughs> you see, he's copying, the, he's, he's copying the Greek. You see how stupid you are. You used to prove to me that Muhammad is a false man. If we go in the Quran, we are, if we go in the Quran, we will find that Allah, he called the name of the book of the Christian, what? Do you know the name? Which? 
the name of the Christian book in the Quran. What is the name of the Christian book? The name of the Christian book. Mm. You you don't have a name, but it's called uh, uh, the people of the book. No, Ahl -Kitab. you are being stupid now. This is in jail. You never heard the word in jail. In jail means uh, gospel. Okay, in jail, but isn't it? This is a Greek word. It's not a Greek word. Really? Who is the donkey who said, said that to you? Who said that is a Greek word? You can go right now and search. This is why you say Angelican Church. Do you know what Injil means? In Injil, in Injil, in Injil is about the good news. The good news. Why Allah is using a Greek word in His holy Arabic Quran? If this is a Quran, here we go. Do you see the word Injil? If this is a Quran written in Arabic and Jesus was sent to the Jews, why His book is in a Greek? Yes, this is a big question. Why? Why? You tell me why? Why Allah He chose the name which is the Greek name? Allah He approved the the Greek name. Why Allah He did not choose? Why Allah is not using the name which is the name which should be according to Him? This is the Greek name. How you say the gospel in Arabic? Injil. We don't say we don't have Arabic. We say Injil too. We say Injil. So your God. You don't have any word for gospel. This is Injil. I told you Injil. Are you stupid or what? This is, is not, in Arabic. this is not Arabic. This is a Greek because we don't have the Bible in Arabic. We have translation. The Bible written in Hebrew, in Aramaic, in Greek. And we are a Christian. We use the word Injil. Your prophet is copying the, the, the word from the Christians. He cannot be God. He is copying what the Arab they are using, the Arab Christian they are using. So here, but but by, by doing that, he proved that the, he, is, he is false. Why? Because this is a Greek word. And this is the name of the, of the gospel in Greek. So why Allah is quoting the Greek? And the same and the same for Esau. Esau, Isa is Esau. This is Esau. Esau. So Muhammad, he is copying. He claimed that his God taught him, but the fact your God is learning from the Greek about Christianity. Why didn't he choose the name Jesus? There's no name Jesus. You're crazy. This is a translation later. This is, uh, why, this, is have you this is 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 Jesus and coming from 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 the ASOS ASOS also or uh, uh, like in the, in the in the in the Spanish they say uh, Jesus I think Jesus right so depend on the language so this is coming all from the word Yeshua Yeshua or in Arabic we say Yeshua you're a prophet obviously he is a thief he is copying it from the Injil which is the Greek book claiming that this is what God told him if your Allah is the one who gave him the name then you need to explain to me why he did not quote the name in Hebrew if Jesus was sent to the Hebrew why his book name is in, in Greek let me ask you let me ask you what is the word for gospel in Arabic I just told you we don't have one are you stupid or what <laughs> We use Injil, we use Injil, we use the Greek word. We don't have one because we are not giving, we are not giving a book in Arabic. Don't be stupid. We are giving Injil. So we in our churches, we use the word Injil. You are being dumped now. So the word Injil is a Greek. Muhammad, he took it from us. Why Allah, he claimed, why you claim that this is from God, but yet he is calling the book which he sent to Jesus Injil. Why, why, why are you listen, Abdul? You Abdul, Arabic listen, liar. listen. If Jesus Injil was is in Arabic name for gospel. No, it's not. It's a Greek word. Yes, it is. <laughs> why are you lying? <laughs> what is Torah? Torah in which, which, in which language is Torah? Torah, Torah is a Hebrew. It's not ah, Arabic. So now it become Hebrew. Yes, it is Hebrew. It's not an Arabic. So now your God Allah, He quoted the word in wrongly because He is quoting the. If, if He, you see the the, the, the stupid Muslims did, didn't understand that the second you quote the word in Jil, that's meaning you approve the Greek version of the Bible as simple as that, and that means all the claim of Muslims that Jesus was sent to the Hebrew and Allah He gave Him the book in Hebrew. It's a lie. Because as you see, the name which Allah He chose to name the book which He sent to Jesus, He chose the Greek word. Your first God all, Allah is copying all, the Greek. First of all, there was no book in the time of Jesus when He was alive, which was named Injil or Gospel or whatever. Really? Second of all. Okay, hold on. No, no, no. We start with first of all. No, no, no. We stop with first of all. Let me get you busted. Isn't it you? It's it in front of us. Are you stupid or what? 
how you say to me that he he was not having a book it's called in Jesus time and the Quran says which is the Injil and let us go and see what Jesus received from the Quran here we go we go chapter 3 verse number 48 this one is about who yes can I answer mm. without you uh, stop me yeah this is about who yes. this verse yes and he will teach him the scripture and wisdom and the Torah and the gospel okay what is the word gospel here yes it is it is in jail in jail thank you very much so who yes. is the one who hey, gave hey, can you wait? Oh. Wait one second. Wait. Uh -huh. wait. Uh, the the injil was the wahi. It was the revelation which come to Jesus in 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 uh, uh, word word form. It was not in book form. Mm. So everything that Jesus said. Okay, hold on. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. Okay, hold on, 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 hold on. Do you see here? It says where you are alimu hul kitab. It says in the front of us where you alimu hul kitab. Huh? Huh? What does the word kitab yes, mean? But th this is uh, uh, how you say it. Uh, like uh, it's it's in the tablets in the heaven that is only God uh, can see. You know, it was not. Ah, okay, guys, hold on. Here we arrive to Israfil. According to you Muslims, Allah have a book and He put it between the two eyes of the angel Israfil. Is that correct? It's a tablet which is in the heaven. I know, I know. Is it is it true that Allah He put the tablet between the eyes of the angel Israfil? Why are you talking about this, my friend? I Why am talking you about this because you are saying to me that Allah is teaching her. Okay, hold on, hold on. Okay, let me let me show you what you just said to me. Allah He have a book. It is between the eyes of the angel, and He is teaching just from that book. Did you say that? It is written in the tablet. The no Torah problem. No problem. No problem. No problem. Indeed. Okay. Okay. So Allah have a book. Hold on. Allah has a book, and He is teaching Jesus from that book, which is between the two eyes of the angel. Yes or no? I don't know what you're talking about. You just so said that. You just said to me. I said to you, "What is the kitab?" You said to me, "Allah have a book. He have a tablet." So Allah, He, he books, have a books, 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 books. What books? Books, it's the Injil, it's the Torah, it's the Sabur, it's the Furkan. Furkan is Quran. So a, a second ago, the, you see how stupid you are. A second ago, you told me that Injil is not a book. Now you're saying to me it's a book. But it's in the tablet form, tablet in the heaven. <laughs> okay, where is the tablet? It's in the heaven. Where? In the heaven. Where, where, where? Is it a true? Where, where? You, you why you don't? Yes, yes, there's a location be, between you know, but no. between the eyes of the angel Jibri uh, Israfil. Yes or no? I don't know what you're talking about, so I cannot say yes or no. Okay, if other you want me show, you want me show you. Show me, show me, then we can talk. I don't know okay. what you're talking okay. about uh, between eyes and between legs. All right. What okay. 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 Uh, okay. 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 Uh, Lawhul Mahfuz. Mahfuz. What does that mean? Protected, yes. Hmm. By who? So protected in the heaven. In by the by, by who? By who? By Allah. Not by Allah. By Israfil. Okay, if you want Israfil. <laughs> Let us read together and laugh. All right. Tafsir al Quran al Azim. Okay. Let us see. <clears throat> Uh, uh, your your uh, stream have uh... what? My stream is not coming. No, it's coming. It's fine. Is my stream coming, guys? All right. Here we go. Chapter eighty-five, verse number twenty-two. It says, "Fi lawhin mahfuz." We go to Ibn Kathir. 8522 what you want to come with this hold on hold on hold on you said to me show me I told you between the two eyes of an angel because that will prove to us that Allah is a, is a false God chapter you see the screen chapter 85 verse number 22 and this is Ibn Kathir your favorite scholar okay Mm 
but you know why nobody wants to debate with you? Mm, yeah, we know. Here we go. Read with me. You know why? Okay, read with me. Read with me. Okay. You see, guys, here, the Muslim translation in English, this is a proof, again, that Muslims are a bunch of liars. I open in English. It's taken off. I cannot find it in English. If we go in Arabic, we will find the following. In, uh, in English, they took off where it says that Allah, he put between the two eyes of the angel Jibreel. This is the English one. I cannot find that. If we go to the Arabic Ibn Kathir, read carefully with me. It says, and you speak Arabic, right? No, I don't speak Arabic. Oh, I forgot. Okay. Read, guys. Whoever speak Arabic, read with me and laugh. Why the Muslim, they lie? Because this is funny and stupid. And he says, uh, from, 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 etc., etc., that he said, uh, 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 blah, 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 okay. And, and Muqatil ibn Jurayj and Mujahid and Ibn Abbas, Ibn Abbas said, in the in the front of the uh, the, the book it says la ilaha illallah only and his religion is islam and muhammad is his messenger in the top of the tablet galaxy uh, 10 it says shahada okay okay just to show you how the, the, the hypocrisy and they worship a man allah himself he wrote in his tablet which nobody can see there is no God but Allah and Muhammad is the messenger. That's it. Okay. And now we continue. And he says, and he وقال, واللوح لوح من درة بيضاء طوله ما بين السماء والأرض. And the and the board, the tablet of Allah, is made from uh, 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 white uh, 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 pearl. And his uh, the uh, the distance or the size of it is the same size between what is between the earth and the heaven. And the distance, the width, the, the the width of it is between the same as between the east and the west, and the edge of it is covered by pearls and and and, and rubies, and uh, and uh, and and the side of it, in one of the side, there is a a, a, a ruby made a, a, red, a red. They did not lose me. Hold on. What is nur? Hold on. L uh, uh, light. Ah. Uh. Did the guys lose me? In the screen yes okay yes, hold on you, it's black okay give me a second <laughs> okay let, let me call you back hold on i don't know why we lost it <clears throat> Okay, I hope now it's coming, guys. Let me know if the screen is coming. Is my screen coming, guys? All right, good. Okay, we go back. Uh, I will call you back, uh, Abdul. Hold on. All right. Okay. So let us let, let's make it clear. In English, the Muslims they lie to us and they took it off from English. Do you have an idea why in English translation in the Biblia theory they did not put this? No. Why? Okay. Now let me ask you. You are the one who mentioned that to me, and it says that Allah He put the uh, He put the tablet between the eyes of the uh, the, the, the the angel uh, Israfil, and it says لا يؤذن له بالنظر فيه. He is not allowed to look at it. Now I want to ask you. Why Allah he have a tablet? Why? Yes. Uh, you can ask him when you uh, meet him. I don't know. Okay, why. what is why? the purpose of a tablet for us, you and me, when we have a tablet? We are a human being. We write in a tablet. Why we write in a tablet? It says right. here, it says here that Allah the hadith says that Allah the first thing he created it was the pen correct no okay so Allah he created the pen and he told the pen to write in the tablet correct I don't know about that okay well I can show you the reference no problem 
Now, you agree, me and you, that Allah have a tablet according to Islam? Yes, yes, okay. it's a tablet in the heaven, yes. Okay, why he need the tablet? You said you do not know. I, uh, for me, uh, it says there that this is Lohan Mahfud, which means the protected tablet. Mm -hmm. Okay, the protected tablet, does it have the fight between Muhammad and his wives? Does have what Say the fight? Again? The fight between Muhammad and his wives. Uh, everything in, uh, from the Quran is there. Yes. Okay. What? Uh, what is the benefit to Allah to have a tablet? And there he wrote the story of the fight of Muhammad and his wives. What that will do to Allah? Why Allah? He need to. I mean, what kind of God? Allah. He write in his book, in the day of Monday, four p.m. The Prophet he have a wife fighting with him and they have a strike and they start to throw in rocks and shoes at the windows and the news came to me and i decide to send inspiration with jibril and i told jibril you better behave your wives otherwise i will replace you and i will spank you and i am going to send all the muslims to fight against you and not only that i will take the side of muhammad and jibril too and not only that I will order all the believers to take arms against you and not only that all the angels they will take a side with you is that from God and written in the tablet of Allah of course okay so are you saying to me that your God Allah is a stupid he's not stupid so why he is why this verse is made and written in the tablet give me the purpose of it because it's an ayah, every ayah which is it's from okay. Him, what what make it ayah? Do you know what ayah mean? Ayah mean a miracle, right? Yes, okay. Every, every, what every is a miracle about it? Let me tell you what is a miracle about it. This is a two women, an old woman, speaking to the her neighbor, and they are fighting about the husband. Hey, you, huh? If you don't repent to Allah, huh? Allah will send, uh, Allah will take the side of the prophet, and uh, not only that. He will uh, Jibril too will take his side, okay. And not only that, all the believers, in case you do not know, and please stop biting your nails. I just paint my nails yesterday, okay. Stop doing that. And if you don't stop going attacking the prophet, the angel Jibril he take the side of Allah, of the prophet. And not only that, all the believers, and not only that, all the angels. All of this to a fight between a guy and his two wives. Allah, yes. all with us, Allah and the angels and Jibreel and the believers and every person in this earth taking the side of the prophet against what? Against two women, they are five foot tall. Mm -hmm. Don't you see that this is a very silly to be in the tablet of Allah and even Allah to talk about it? No, why you 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 ha have you studied in lit liter literature? Yeah, I did. I did. This is silly because uh, are you saying to me your Allah is making literature? So Allah here is writing a story about a women, two women. They are a threat to Muhammad to the point he needed the support of Allah and Jibreel, and every and one point four billion Muslims they would take arms, taken side by side by Muhammad, and on top of that all the angels. Look, so look at this five guys. We have we have here as you see in the screen we have a guy poor guy his name is Muhammad he have many wives two of them they have a, a two parties so Allah he sent the verse just for the women saying if you too turn in repentance to him your heart are indeed so inclined but if you back each other against him which means Muhammad truly Truly Allah is his protector and Jibreel and every righteous one among the people. Guys, my friend, if you are exist at that time, are you going to take your sword and stand next to Muhammad to fight his wives? I think I say this is a silly question, you know, because uh, you, you have no, uh, first of all, you have no respect when you speak about this. I don't respect Sixth for sure. All, yeah. Second of all, hmm. you uh, you are thinking about uh, very very stupid things when you read this. Like what? What kind of God? He says, "Are you are you?" I, I'm asking you, are you going to take the side of Muhammad against his two two wives? Yes or no? Let me ask you. 
don't ask me answer the question first are you going to take the side of Muhammad against his two wives Muhammad he have a fight with his two wives he is in trouble he need your help so now every single Muslim in the world he have to bear arm and go with the Prophet against two women they are five foot tall are you going to do that as Allah he order or you will not I will go against my my family if it's for Muhammad. thank you very much but here we have a question guys did you hear it now we have a question what kind of God what kind of God he needed you to bear arm with the Prophet against two women if he is Allah if Allah is with me and he is God who could be against me this is what the Bible says if God is with me who could be against me so look what happened here we have two women two women they are five foot tall one of them is a kid and Allah and all the Muslims and Jibreel and all the angels in the world in one side and two women in one side who is the stupid here in this story this is more deeper than you think you, you tell me to... okay tell me the deeper side of it maybe I'm ignorant I'm listening guys do you want to hear the deep the deep side of it people do you want to hear the deep side of it this God obviously Muhammad he used his God for his personal agenda he have two wives he did not know how to control them so he said to himself okay the best the best toy I use the voodoo is Allah I will say to them Allah he said to the to, to you behave or I will destroy you and then he will they will get scared he is using Allah otherwise you tell me what why he needed Allah to the support against two wives yes you 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 are meaning this is a meaningless uh, verse huh Allah. it is why what is the purpose of it why Allah okay. okay hold on no no Allah if Allah if Allah is against them why he need Jibreel why he need every righteous Muslim why he need all the angels it's just a what a fight between two women and the guy he is the husband this is not a fight between USA and America and, and Russia and versus uh, Muhammad it is two wives you see the, the the line up we see here this is enough to fight uh, uh, Soviet Union maybe uh, USA we are not talking about a war between like a, an army a great army it's two women why he needed all those to support him have you heard about Samson Samson yeah what is that Samson no, I did not hear it. No, what is that? Is that in the Quran? No, it's in your book, the Judge, Judge Book of Judges. Ah, Shamshon. Ah, okay, okay. What about him? Why you change the topic now? What, what is it? Uh, so, what, what are you? What are you trying this to? Is the same, this is a. This is the same thing. No, 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 no. Not that. That one is about sin. The, the whole story there is about sin. If you disobey God, if you obey with a sin, then you are away from God. You lose your your power. You lose the support of God. Samson is not strong because of uh, uh, long hair samsung is a strong because he was with god the second he obeys sin he lost his power god is with me here we see that a guy he is fighting with two women and those two women they are so powerful to the point they scared the hell of muhammad to the point he needed the support of allah and every believer and jibreel and every single angel furthermore the angels will back him up in what what exactly will happen let us say that those women they are not going to obey Muhammad what those believers and the angels and Allah will do can you tell me but didn't didn't he kill thousand men with a this, uh, this, is, not, uh, this is not this is not this is not so what God is with him God is so with, with him a, with a jaw from a donkey he killed my, thousand my, men. You my, my friend my friend my friend God he can do miracles and he can use any of us if God he want me to destroy a nation he can you know he can God so, our God is real. Here, here we have two Solomon? wives. We have two wives. They Why are, are you looking at Solomon. If you now say God can do everything, then Solomon can do also everything. With no, 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 no. This is this is silly because what what the God can't do anything. Why why Solomon in the flying carpet? I mean Solomon. You are a hypocrite now. No, no. Now I, why why am I a hypocrite? Hold on, hold on. You see, this is a fairy tale story. Can we can find in the books? It's called the Legion of the Jews. So you're a prophet is copying from the legion of the Jews. The Jews believe in their legions, not in their Suleiman, Suleiman is not God. He was a prophet, a messenger of God. Okay. Which would give, give him this power, like Jesus when he when he raised people from the but, dead. But you are saying to me that evil. Allah but uh, you are saying to me that Allah he gave Suleiman an evil power. He became an evil because his employee employee his employee are the devils. No, but they they obeyed him. 
Well, okay, that, that's what friend. I was saying. The so that, 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 that okay, thank you very much. That the devil obey him to do what? To do what exactly? To do this uh, service which he what's wanted. A, what's a, okay, so thank you, so guys. Did you hear it? The one who service Suleiman in Islam is Shaitan. In that, that was the jinn. No, it was not a jinn. Don't lie again. It's a Shaitan. Oh. Don't who, gave, who, who gave who gave the power to Jesus? This is don't change the topic. You keep jumping like a monkey no, I, from Samson to to, to etc. You see, now you go back to zero because you are trying to escape this. We want to go to back. Here we go. We go back. It was shaitan. Don't lie. It was Allah. He ordered Allah. He ordered the shaitan to obey uh, 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 your 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 Suleiman, the, the version of Suleiman, not our Suleiman. Read it. Here we go. But if we go in the Quran, hold on, hold on, hold, hold on. Okay, you see, according to you, he was an idol worshiper. You want to show no. you? You want to show you? Quran is Quran is testifying he was not the idol worshiper. My okay, who who who, 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 is, the, who is the who is the who is the one was idol worshiper? It was not Solomon, according to your Bible. Who is the one? Who is the one? Who is the one? Was idol worshiper? Who is the one? Was idol worshiper? He had thousand concubines, according to. How the don't you, you are jumping like a monkey? Don't make me hang up on you. Who is the one? Was an idol worshiper? According to your Bible, Solomon. But the, the show me the verse. Show me the show me the verse that says that Solomon he is a is an idol worshiper, and I have a news for you. Ah, you, you you have not read? No, you show me no problem, and I will show you something too. What does idol mean? He have a status? Yes, like he worship other beside God. Hmm. You can read in First King. Hmm. First King eleven. Okay, read for us. Go ahead. Hmm? Read for us. Uh, it says that the Solo the, then Solomon built a illegal worship site on the hill east of Jerusalem. Hmm. And and what what does that mean? Why this? You tell me. A, do, a, a do, do, oh, okay, oh, hold on. You, you see. I mean, the Muslims are silly. When you make a claim, explain yeah. to us. Let us see. We want to learn from you. Where it says that? Where, where it says what you are saying? You said you said he worship idols. Where it says that? In the first King eleven, you can read that. Where, where, where? What verse? Where it says that? You can read here. Uh. Do you want me, uh, do you, do you, do you want me to help you? Do you need my help? Yes, Solomon. Uh, yes, to read. Okay, the, as I say in in King, verse number five, that God. First, hold on, hold on. If we go, if we go, if, if you can, you can read from verse number one if you want. Doesn't um, say that. In, if you go read from verse number five, five six, seven, eight, nine, does it say there that God he uh, he was uh, angry from Suleiman? Because he was away from the God of Israel. Uh, because he worshipped idols. Thank you very much. Them. Thank you very much. When when so that is not hold on hold on. Quran we, is saying it's not true. No, here we go. Quran says true, and the Quran no, saying Quran, that Quran, hold on Quran. no no the Quran saying that it's right. Allah he is the one who made him do that. So in the Bible it's condemning Suleiman being away from God. While your God, he is saying, yes, we are the one who made him do that. It was your God, Allah, who made Suleiman build a synagogue with statues. Read with me and love, my friend. Here we go. Quran protected him from this allegation. No, that's a lie, my friend. Here we go. This is your Quran. Everybody will laugh at you in a second. So while the Bible condemn, you see, in, in the Bible, we, we believe that prophet, they commit sin. So here we see that the God of Islam is the one who is teaching his prophet to be pagans. For us today, man, and even David, they commit sin. 
and God but he condemned their behavior and this is the same book you are reading for, for me from but you <laughs> hold on you in your Quran chapter 34 verse number 13 it says that Allah he gave Suleiman the power I ask you why Allah he gave Suleiman the power you said because Allah he wanna give that okay what Suleiman he ordered them he ordered them to build to build synagogue with the statues do you see it Uh, yes. Okay. What kind of God he orders a man to build a statue? I ask you, what is idols? You say to me, statues. You agree that statues. Why Allah is ordering Suleiman to build the statues in his synagogue? Mm -hmm. Hmm? You are the one who said to me in your book. It says this. In my book, it condemn any prophet, anyone. Who, in our book, or the book it says it clearly. That no man, no good, no, no good but God. Only God is good. That is the Messiah. All is a sinner and they need the mercy of the Lord, the forgiveness of the Lord. So Suleiman, David, Musa, anyone, even Peter, even Paul, even everybody, all everybody, there's no human being in the top of this earth is not a sinner and he need the forgiveness of God. And Suleiman is no better. David is no better. So the same chapter you quote for me condemning the behavior of Suleiman, but your Quran saying that Allah is the one who made Suleiman build the statues, and Allah He gave him the power so he can do that, and He did give him the power to control the shaitan. And who is the one who is building the statues for him? The shaitan. Is that true? It's the jinns. You have to understand. Stop it lying. It doesn't say the jinn. Stop being a liar. It says shayateen. Why you are a liar? Does it yes, say? Shayateen, oh, let me shayateen. ask. Okay. Does it say the word shayateen or it says the word jinn? Okay. If you want shayateens. No, no it's not up to me. It's not up to me or to you. Don't say if you want. Say say it as it is. Is it shaitan or it is? It says genie. It says shaitan. So stop lying. Shayateen. Okay. So Allah He gave Suleiman power. They are jinn, but they are the evil one. They are the shaitan. They are yes. Satan. Okay, yes. thank you. Okay, so the evil shaitan, hold on. So the evil shaitan is helping Suleiman to build idols. Why? And but Allah is was, the one. There was, and, there was obeying. There was, there was obeying him. He was. A thank you very man. much. Thank you very much. But he was given this by Allah, and Allah is proud about it. Allah, evil. Allah is proud that Suleiman is building statues. Why Allah is proud about that? No, he was. You, you don't understand this. It's not about that. He he worshiped the statues. My friend, why? Uh, you, I said to you, if you have a status, this is we idol. You said no. You said we yes. If if we if are you Muslims allowed to have a statues? But continue. Answer: Are you Muslims allowed to have a statues? No. Why you don't continue read? We'll continue read. Read. Here we go. Who's stopping you? Read what? Read what? Read it. Read it. Read it. Here we go. Read it. Who's holding you? Read it. What? Read what? Okay, go to 14. Here you go. What do you want? Okay, we are on 14. Eh? What? Huh? Huh? Creature of the earth which flew away his staff. And when he felt the gene so clearly, how if they had known the unseen, they would not have continued in this peace toy. <laughs> do you want to see what this is about? You are the one yes. who said to me that you don't believe in fairy tales. If I show you, you are the one who asked me to go to 14. You will regret that in a second. Do you want to show you the interpretation? This is this is this show this show that the jinn they don't know the unseen, only Allah knows. My friend, this is not about the unseen. This is about being your God being a fairy tale, stupid tailor. You want me to show oh, you the interpretation? This is about the unseen. Okay, hold on. Here we go. Guys, he is the one who asked me. He is the one who forced me to go to 14. In a second, he will regret. Chapter 34, verse number 14. Hold on. I never regret the, the book is perfect. Okay, oh, okay, never... right, okay, perfect. Okay, let us see. Mm. Here we go. Chapter 34, verse number 14. Perfect. Very perfect. I mean, we have to see how perfect it is. All right. It says here that this man. Hmm? Let us go. Let's go actually to Ibn Kathir in English first. Did you say that uh, Jesus is not hold from this on, world? Hold on, hold on. Yes, he is not. And you, you said to me you will believe in that, and you, 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 you said yes, I do, and then you swallow your tongue. 
because you are a coward. But if he's not from this world, just wait, let me ask you, how can he be he said, hungry? He said, I am from above. But how can he be hungry? Because he is in the flesh of a human being. Ah, then he's, he's from this world. Mm, ah, that to prove that he is from this world. Ah, but because uh, this is the only thing proved that he is from this world. Ah, when he got, when he, okay, he, let me ask you, the, let, let me let me ask you, do Allah forget? When he go to the do, tree, do Allah forget? Do Allah do Allah forget? Don't change topic, you coward! Don't you keep jumping like a like a monkey? Do Allah forget? Do Allah forget? <laughs> do Allah forget? Yes or no? What do, what do you mean forget? Do Allah forget? Yes or no? What do you mean with forget? Forget, forget. Mean? I forget. You forget. I forget your name. No, he never forget. Okay, if I show you from the Quran that Allah, he forget. He what? never forget. He's Allah. He can okay. never forget. Aren't you the one who said to me that Allah, he have a tablet? He have a tablet, yes. Okay. Why he have a tablet? Because he forget. No, it's not about. So why? He, so why he have a? So why he have a? Why he have a? We have. A, why he have a tablet? Then tell us. Go ask, the, the, the wisdom. Allah don't forget. Why he have a tablet? Because you you can ask him when you see him. No, ah, no so you know you're just a kid. Get lost. Get lost. Don't call me again. Go, each time I get you in the corner, you say to me, you can ask me when you see him. I will never see him. It's false. Mari ikut Yesus. Mari ke jalan yang benar. Tuhan berkati.